water on us made up. All atoms contain the nucleus and the electrons. The nucleus in the center of the atom consists of a club of protons and neutrons. Around the outside of the atom are electrons. The nucleus stays still, and the electron moves around the nucleus at tremendous speeds, up to 100 trillion times per second. The atom has no outside skin, just a blur of electrons speeding around. Even the the protons, neutrons, and electrons are too small to see. We know their sizes compared to each other. Pretend you're in a huge sports stadium. Imagine there is a ping pong ball in the middle of the field. If the sports stadium were the size of one atom, that ping pong ball would be the size of its nucleus. Now imagine a swarm of tiny mosquitoes zooming around the outer edge of the stadium. That's how small the electrons would be. What is between the nucleus and the electrons? Nothing. Most of the atom is empty. In order to make the tremendous variety of things on Earth and in outer space, you would have to think there would have to be millions or billions of different kinds of atoms. The amazing thing is, there are only 92 different kinds of atoms found in nature. That means only 92 different kinds of building blocks. How are the 92 kinds of atoms different from each other? Each one has a different number of protons and neutrons in its nucleus and a different number of electrons whizzing around it. The lightest atom has only one proton in its nucleus and one electron zooming around it. The heavy heaviest atom has 92 protons and 146 neutrons in its nucleus, and 92 electrons whizzing around it.